well thank you so much hello audience everybody okay or welcome this is students i uh, instantly solve these questions criterion question to solve binomials questions and binomial theorem uh, so lot of questions are solved in previous lecture then obviously you have to watch this lecture then this maths are easiest and easily so uh, you have to uh, practice in deeply so then now at present this solve uh, the questions find the three of terms in x of the expansion of terms at the hold to the word 6 so uh, find the question is easily and easiest if you are deeply thinking that's the moment find the free of terms in x of the expansion of terms well given the expansion of terms x square minus 2 plus 1 by x square whole to the power 6 then x square minus twice a b plus b square equal to a minus b whole square so 6 ja 2 equal to 12 then x minus 1 by x whole to the power 12 we have to uh, r plus 1 terms of the expansion uh, is equal to t r plus 1 equal to n c r a to the power n minus r x to the power r so uh, 12 c r x to the power r x minus 12 minus r minus 1 by x to the power x to the power r is so easiest things no problems carry on in study uh, so 12 c r x to the power 12 minus 2 Minus one to the power r. Since since uh, uh, look at the board, three of terms in x, three of terms in x is the expansion of x minus one by x to the power two. That's why since the three of term in x, uh, three of term in x of the expansion, you have to deeply thinking. Three of terms. Three of terms means three of terms. That's why x to the power twelve uh, minus two r equal to x to the power zero. That's why twelve minus two r equal to equal to zero. So that implies twelve equal to two r. That implies r equal to six. So r equal to six. Then this terms of three uh, of terms is equal to uh, t t of t of t of six plus one t of six plus one equal to t of seven equal to Twelve c six uh, x to the power zero uh, minus one to the power six. That's why twelve c six uh, minus one to the power six minus one to the power six. That's equal to twelve c six. Twelve c six. That means uh, that means. 12 c 6 equal to you have to use in calculator. Then obviously uh, you you can get the result automatically. Uh, that's why uh, equal to uh, 9 9 2 4 is a answer. So well uh, is a is a thing and you have to practice. the practice in uh, any moment or any place no problems are you have to t to t7 equal to 12 c 6 x to the power 0 minus 1 to the power 
equal to F. It's the easiest and easy maths. Obviously, you have to solve this any moment or any place. Now, these questions are uh, find the period terms of x of the expansion is so separate, is so separate. So, uh, key 1 plus x whole to the power p equal to 1 plus 1 by x whole to the power q whole to the power q whereas p and q p and q are p and q are positive integer p and q are positive integer I think you have to clear this process and clear this maths. So, given the function, given the expansion of function, 1 plus x whole to the power p, 1 plus 1 by x whole to the power q. Well, uh, if so, easiest ways, so you have to calculate these the terms, uh, these the terms. 1 plus x is well p and x plus 1 is q divided by x to the power q. That's why 1 by x to the power q equal to 1 plus x whole to the power p plus q. p plus q. Since, since 1 plus x whole to the power p plus q uh, at expansion of terms in x in x who's the who's the terms who's the terms of who's the Three of terms in X. That's why R plus one term or TR plus one equal to equal to N C R X to the power R since the since this term of x to the power q x to the power q therefore therefore 
x to the power r equal to x to the power q. That's why r equal to q. So then, therefore, the free of terms, free of terms q plus 1 is equal to p plus q c q. C q. That's why you have to clear this mass P plus Q factorial Q factorial P plus Q minus Q factorial equal to P plus Q factorial divided by factorial P and factorial Q. This is the result. And the period of terms the free of terms in x q plus 1 equal to p plus q c q that's equal to p plus q factorial divided by q factorial q minus p plus q minus q factorial that's why q factorial q p plus q factorial by q Q Q bar factorial P. Factorial P and factorial Q is the result. So, you have to clear this maths. It's so critical, but not so critical if you are deeply think and deeply practice. Thank <laughs> you.